Welcome back to King's Quest. My name is Usser. Into town with my last coin. Yeah, I, I already I saw this. Anyway, so eye, I was curious cheap. because Manny is. Uh, oh, now I'm spacing his name, and I feel so bad about that. He's the actor who did Vicini from The Princess Bride, and so it made me curious. So I went to the IMDb of this and looked up the voice actors, and like the old king is Christopher Lloyd. Doc from Back to the Future! Oh my god! Turns out that this blacksmith girl is Zelda Williams, Robin Williams' daughter. I was like, oh! There, there's so many people in this who sound familiar and I couldn't quite place the name, so I had to look up who the voice actors were. But now, when it comes to progressing in the story, I want to go over here and help... What's her name? Amaya? Amara? I want to help her out now. I'm gonna help out Zelda. Hey, Graham. If you like sharp things, you've come to the right place. I love them. We em. have over 23. Oh, forgive me. Last night was a little rough. I woke up on the floor. My bed nowhere to be found. Can you believe that? What type of Yahoo steals a bed while you're sleeping in it? And the most curious part, huh. nothing else is missing. Anyway, uh, probably a, a dragon. Around. Let me know if something piques your interest. Okay. I'd be happy to. I'd also like to help you. Oh, that's cool. Don't touch that, Graham, or you might be the one losing an eye. Oh, but but it's cool! Back away from the crumbler. Unless you have 50 gold coins for a work order. No, I don't. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm just... How much for that twisty dagger over there? It's not for sale. Needs a bit more work. Okay. How much for that twisty oh, dagger did. over there? It's not for sale. Needs a bit more work. You can post a work order on anything you want lifted, chopped, or crumbled. Then I'll bring out Mrs. Crumbler to fulfill the order. Cool. All right. I don't even know if Hello. she will help me, but... Where can I find a hideous beast eye? Do you have any idea where I can hunt down an eye of a hideous beast? What a glorious day for a tournament. My favorite time of year. Fire ride new recruits, the clanks and clinks of armor clashing, and the action the very finest. One hopeful always rises to the occasion. I love it all. Some people in town, they complain about the barbaric events, but it's a tradition I'm proud to be a part of. If I was competing, I'd go after the biggest, scariest beast I could find, even if it meant certain death. As they say, fortune favors the bold. You, on yeah. the other hand, look like you spend a lot of time in your head, trying to figure out all the possibilities before making a move. Pick a plan and go. Too much time thinking leads to inaction, and inaction is just boring. Okay. Um, what was so, that weapon on the wall? I've been meaning to ask. What is that amazing blade for? Is it for battling vicious werebears? How many ice orcs has it slain? Does it deal justice? Is it road legal? Is it made of fear? Is it road legal? Oh, that? No, no, that's for gardening. I use it to trim my hedges. Seeing as my place is all tended to, and my petunias are most lovely, I'm willing to part with it for the price of one shiny gold coin. Hell yeah! I'm sure you've got a prickly situation that needs attending. Yeah, I do. How much for that gardening tool? One shiny gold coin. Yeah, I asked that, but I, I've got Bye. one. Wait, Don't what? forget leg day. <laughs> oh. Don't touch that, Graham, or you might be the one losing an eye. But, 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 but I want it. I've got one gold coin. I've got one. <sighs> All right, well, we'll go do some things. Let's go figure out what this shop is. I didn't go in there before. I didn't even know that it was necessarily a door I could go in. Oh, it's the baker's. Wow. Hello there, and what a mustache. Um, forgive the shop from lacking our usual favorites. With all the bridges out and my supplier missing, I can't keep all my delicious treats stocked. But uh, have a look around. I'm here to answer any questions. I kind of feel like I need to go buy the gardening tool and trim his mustache. I make frosting in the day for pastries, and in the night for nibbling. Oh, custard! Oh, just like my mom used to make. Oh, I'm saving that pie for a special occasion. 
sorry. No problem. I'm just looking around. The sign read, ask us about our free samples. I want free samples. Oh, he walks so slow. I hope you're hungry. Uh, free, free samples. samples? Oh, today only. I'm letting people sample our new walnut strudel. Awesome. However, I ran out of bitter root. It's really nasty on its own, but it really brings out the nutty flavor of the strudel. It usually grows under big, heavy rocks. If you can find me some, you can have all the free samples you want. Yeah! That's Got any not a delicious eyes baking back there? hideous beast's eye cake I smell cooking, is it? Looking for an eye, are you? Well, it must be that time of year again. Frankly, I can't tolerate it. The Fays weren't raised that way. It's archaic! So much fighting and needless killing! Compassion comes from the heart, you know? As does food! If you want to get to the heart of any problem, all you need is pie! I know it doesn't sound logical, but I believe that we need to stop thinking with our heads and start opening our hearts! He's making all kinds of sense. Stop fighting wars and everybody eat a pie. Hell yeah! I'm, I'm on par with that. What's yep. today's special? I, I'm great with that. Well, today I am baking up quite the treat. Grandma's star shroom pie. A delicacy big enough to feed an army. Or someone with the appetite of an army. I've eaten it in one sitting before. I, okay. Well, don't judge. Hey. No one would trust a skinny baker, now would they? B well, you got a point there. My ingredients haven't been delivered. But I can't complete the recipe. Until those bridges get fixed, people will just have to settle for the love in my goat hoof pie instead. Oh. Ah, uh, tell you what. If you can find me some starberries and sugar shrooms, you can have this monster pie for the discounted price of one gold coin. Good day. Have a sweet time. Wow, I thought grandpa's jokes were bad, but no. That was really bad. What the, give me a second. I'm, uh, okay. I just knocked. <sighs> you aren't the delivery boy, are you? No. A merchant is usually so prompt with our air, miraculous, and oftentimes delicious ingredients. Oh, horse feathers, Chester. This boy's no courier. He desires a position in King Edward's court. He's yeah. a thinking soul just like us. If he continues down this path, he will have no trouble defeating the contenders in this year's night tournament. Zounds! Did you just read my fortune? No, we're just very old and very judgmental people. <laughs> this is my judging face. <laughs> I don't read fortunes anymore. Oh, man. Yep. There was no future in it. <clears throat> yeah, we couldn't tell fortunes <sighs> if we wanted to. Some scoundrel stole our fortune table whilst we were watching the parade. Mm-hmm. You haven't seen anyone rolling around Devontry with our tabletop, have you? Uh, I apologize. I'm sorry. I couldn't find anyone to pay. A man was stranded in the forest and needed a wheel, so I borrowed your table and lent it to him. Oh, that's actually pretty clever. Honesty is the best policy. <laughs> we were about to toss that old table anyway. Glad it's being put to use. Oh, well, thank, thank you. Doors. We don't have to lock our doors anymore. I think we're safe now. Thanks for being honest, boy. No problem. Ground, boy. Let us know if you like anything you see. Do you have a piteous beast eye? Something mysterious and magical was brewing in that pot. Yeah, it twinkles too. It looked like some type of broken lantern. What are these little guys? Those are bird bombs. 
Our own invention. Kinda like a smoke bomb, but they release gas that will cause your victim to cluck like a chicken. <laughs> Temporarily, of course. That's Those awesome. Those ones are expired, though, so they're just for display. Could I have one? I don't care if it is expired. That's great. Something mysterious no. and magical was brewing in that pot. Okay, yes, let's talk sir? to him. How much for that candle? How much for that candle? Our everlasting blue flame lantern? The housing's broken. Someone brought it in for repair but never paid. Tell you what, if you bring us something we can hollow out to house the candle, you can have it for the price of one shiny gold coin. Do you have Do any, any eyes? eyes of hideous beasts in stock? An eye, you say? Yes, yes. Uh, your name, please? Uh, it's Graham. Last name? Graham. Graham, Graham, with a G, I assume. Hmm. I don't see your name on this list. Oh, you did pre-order, right? Uh, no. Pre-order? Oh, yes, this time of year, our eyes fly off the shelves. Of but course they do. You pre-ordered. You're out of luck. Our eyes are completely on back order. If you'd like, we can put you on the waiting list for our next shipment. When will that arrive? We get shipments every eight months. Oh, jeez. I'm afraid that won't work. Well, hang on a sec. It's Graham, right? May we bend your ear for a bit? Bend away. You need an eye for the tournament, I'm guessing. Yep. Yes, I have always dreamed of becoming a knight. Why? With Daventry's addendums this and proclamations that, it seems a frightful business. Do you have any idea how many royal guards we lose to that voracious moat monster? Well, my father was a knight, and my grandfather was a knight, and my great-grandfather... Well, he was a dentist, but his father was a knight. Basically, I come from a long line of protecting crowns. I started looking for knight jobs while I was still in the academy, but once I graduated, all the opportunities... Knight jobs? Up. Really? I might not fit in here, but Aventry's my last shot. Oh, you'll fit in just fine. It might be too late to capture the rule-defined eye of a hideous beast, but rules will bend for those who can outsmart the rule-makers. Okay. So, I've just got to know, what is brewing in that cauldron? Is it a transfiguration elixir? Is it an invincibility potion? If I drink it, will I understand the language of creatures? Will I sprout the wings of an eagle? Or a fly? Oh, this? Teeth whitening potion. No, oh, it's gonna change <laughs> everything. Watch this. Behold the power of whitening. Oh well, oh well. Oh well, we're still working out the kinks. <laughs> While we're still in the prototype phase, feel free to dip whatever you want in there free of charge. Fare thee well. May your quest be logic field. Okay. All right. How'd the bell work on that? How'd the bell... <sighs> I wanted to use the bell and put it in there, but I guess not. All right. So I got nothing out of these shops. Um, I really don't know what I'm supposed to do. Let's go back and see if there's someone else that I can talk to. Because I went back this... I came right into town, but there was other... Places I could go. Or maybe not. Especially if you get stuck on rocks. Fun. By the way, what is... Can I look at this? King Edward gave us everything we have. His legacy was tarnished in his later years, but he was a once great man. And he left me with a daventry to grow into the kingdom it is today. Okay. So, let's go this way. Hmm. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> what a peculiar trap. Let's get caught by it.
Ah. Fantastical floating island. Only steps away. It's so floaty! You'll be amazed. Fantastical floating island. Only steps away. It's so floaty. You'll be amazed. World's greatest and only floating island. Don't turn right. No floating islands that way. Don't tell Star me how to live my life. A serene view. Shame about that buzzing beehive, though. My love, you're my everything. I might not have enough money for a ring yet, but I just can't wait any longer. Will you be mine forever? I better put this back. Bees! Not the, the bees! bees <laughs> that lovely meal. I tucked the berries away for later, though I was craving a cliffside snack. But we've got our starberries for the baker. Was it starberries? In like sugar shrooms or something? Kids, don't stop screaming until dad pulls over the wagon! Yeah, except then you're gonna get spanked. Caution! This was on my bucket list. I'm gonna try everyone I find. It doesn't even look like it's floating. It looks like it's being suspended. Oh, typical tourist trap, man. Here I was excited because it's so floaty, but no, no, it's a lie. All right, let's go up here. Those look like shrooms. Moving any further in the dark seemed like a bad idea. So I'd need the candle to come in here. Don't worry. The Wedzels will be here soon, Princess Madeline. I wasn't always the master archer you see before you now. How'd you learn? <laughs> we'll get to that part. Ugh. Maybe I need to go talk to a Chaka. Seriously, I, I really want to set off this trap, just because he'll probably say something hilarious. Oh ho. I guess not. Okay, we know we can fall in there and it's not a problem, but whatever. Whatever. Hmm. All right, give me a minute while I continue to explore. That that's bad. Told you 
told you it's not polite to go stomping around on people's backs. I apologize. Give me one good reason not to gobble you up right now. Uh, okay, I will return with go. better tasting I can food. Return to you with bundles of royal food. You see, I I'm training to be a knight. If you release me, I'll make sure the king rewards you for your troubles. Hmm. You're a little scrawny for a knight. A long neck and a silly feather like that. <laughs> Are you sure you aren't a goose? Yes, I am quite sure I am not a goose. That's exactly what a goose would say. No, Lucky a goose would you, say honk honk. The taste of goose. The feathers are bad for digestion. Now, what do you want from Ulfie, Goosey? Um, <clears throat> where are those weird what instruments? Are those weird instruments around the bridges for? Usually those horns are used to summon its associated bridge troll to fill the gap. But we have removed all mouthpieces until we get word from the head of the guild. Ulfi was instructed to keep all his horns hidden from humans. <laughs> I keep mine under my butt. Shh. Um, why are all the other Can bridges you share out? With me why all the bridges seem to be missing in Daventry? Well, little goosey, until further notice, the Bridge Troll Guild is officially on strike. But for too long have we the bridges have been stomped on by sharp pointed shoes of the puny guards. And do they care that my back breaks out in an itchy rash from all that marching? Of course not. As Pilar says, for shame, Daflintry. We're not going back to work until the kingdom can take better care of their roads. I should be at the meeting. Perofi always shows up fashionably late, <laughs> right when the croissants are served. Okay. You wouldn't happen to know where I can find an eye of a beast, would you? Is it time for the tournament already? I thought that was on Tuesday. <laughs> oh, bother. My memory's failing again. Alfie's been suffering from sleep deprivation. A very rude monster has been snarling in the bushes behind my back. Is this monster you speak of hideous, perchance? Snarling Snarlax is legendarily hideous. Those puny guards of Daventry would surely be impressed by his eye. It is rumored the beast has two purple eyes with bright blue glowing pupils, six legs, three claws, and one tooth. I could let you cross and perhaps even help you with that fire-eyed monster, but since Ulfi didn't eat you, Ulfi needs a pick-me-up. This big tooth is a sweet one. <laughs> <laughs> if you bring me something to eat, I'll consider helping you. So I need to bring him stuff from the baker, back, and he'll help me kill that thing. Starving. All right, I'll I'll do my best, Ulfi. I just need some shrooms. I don't think I went this way either. Oh, hey. Uh, oh, ah, ah, ah. Get off me! That pumpkin was housing too many squirrels for my taste. Hmm. What do we got here? What was that? A fruit picker. Oh, I didn't have to ruin the meal. I'm so sorry to whoever that... Uh, so, so sorry. That was my bad. A new kind of horn, but the same result. I feel so terrible now. They're they're like gonna propose to each other, and I totally destroyed their meal. Hello, Froggy. Well, you are hiding, hideous beast. I was too slow to catch those frogs. Whisper wouldn't be. Nothing there. Looks like we could put some love on those bones. Good day. Have a sweet day. 
these starberries are perfectly ripe. Just squishy enough, and with a faint scent of musky cabbage. Now, if you can find me the sugar shrooms, she's all yours. For the discounted rate of one shiny gold coin. Musky cabbage? Oh! I saw those shrooms and I was hopeful. So I'll have to climb over the top, but at least I'm helping keep the wolves out of town. Yeah. Oh, I bet you I'd need the gardening tool to go to the dragon's lair. I would. I've got a gold coin. What? Oh, because it's in my inventory! <sighs> I'm dumb. It's in my inventory. I have to give her the gold coin, and then she'll give me that awesome gardening tool. Heck yeah! I have multiple avenues to do things, but I want that cool gardening tool. Hey, Graham. Did you do it? Did you spend your only gold coin on the epic weed whacker? Yeah, I did. I did. The bold costs a fortune. Now, Graham, promise me you will only use this for its intended purpose. I shall be brave in all my hedge trimmings. Those plants will never see it coming. Thanks. I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go out there and try and go towards the dragon now, because I bet you this is what I need. Was that what that was about? Can I reel him in? <laughs> That'd be funny. A few steps behind, but I was hopeful a beast was in that well, and I wanted an eye to impress everyone. But Grandpa, the dragon lives down there. I didn't know that yet, Gwendolyn, and pretend you don't either. This story takes place before the one I told you last night. Sometimes a story is best told out of order. Oh. Is that how the yes. dragon lost that other eye was a chaka? Huh. I was out of my league down there, but I had something to should I hit the other one and have the table take me out again? Hi. Uh, hey, whatever's down here, it's mine.
it's the Lama. Afamata. 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 So I've got to follow him, huh? Water. Ooh. Afamata. 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 Not sure what you're saying, but thanks. Water. Okay. And then we pause there. Water. not what I wanted to do. I'm I didn't get that one. You walk, then fly. I took the long way, he took the astounding way. No matter, that I would be mine. Ah. <laughs>
<laughs> Gravity's working. Oh, please don't let me land in the cage. You're gonna use me as bait, aren't you? Really? Come on, man, help me out. <laughs> I can fit through that. I'll give you the nod. Yeah. Puka. Off and on. Puka. Stalama, Stalama. Uh, now we're talking. Oh, oof. I'm free. Hey, good looking out. A chaka. Huh. Ah, bones. Last meal. Yeah, chew on that bone. Who's a good boy? Tie it to the dragon's tail. Dragon's tail over there, see it? Okay, just save. That's a good spot to stop right now before I screw up and die again. Whew, still haven't got the eye yet, but things are progressing. I got that awesome tool that I probably threw away. Anyway, leave a like, comment, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit the notifications menu bell so you can see whenever i upload new videos it says exit to main menu it distracted me stop by facebook stop by twitter get all the latest news there thank you guys so much for joining me catch you all in the next one bye